Hi, it's Tay. Welcome one more time. Today, we're going to be talking about something crazy. This man was on C-SPAN a few years back, apparently, and this video is circulating about him talking about exterminating white people. Now, if you like the content on this channel, please make sure that you subscribe, like, comment, share. I love engaging with you. I engage daily on my stories via Instagram or via my stories on Instagram whenever I can, whenever the app is not going crazy. So make sure you follow me there, Spanglish Generation, on Instagram. And let's get to it. So this man, his name is Kamau Cambon, was apparently on C-SPAN, out of all places, a very public forum, talking about exterminating white people. He's actually talking about Black empowerment and Blacknificent Books, author and owner of Blacknificent Books. Now, if you look online, and I'll try to find the actual, the full video, because this is the clip of what I need to, you know, react to. But the full video, he says something that I actually, estoy muy de acuerdo. Because, tú sabes, es increíble como dentro de todas las locuras, you always find, you manage to find something that you can actually agree with. And this man says that, he doesn't use the term white supremacy because that would be admitting to the superiority of white people. And I've always said, why the hell do people use the term white supremacy? Because by saying someone is more supreme than you, they have supremacy, you're admitting their supremacy over you. And I don't believe that any person that loves themselves and thinks of themselves as powerful and preaches black power or Latino power or whatever power would think and accept that someone is in fact superior. Pero bueno, así es la vida. Let's get to this guy. Cambon, que es un black power preacher, no, o sea, una persona que preaches black power, Dice lo siguiente, mi amor. Let's get to this because yo no, yo no, tú sabes, I... It is how we are going to exterminate white people because that, in my estimation, is the only conclusion I have come to. We have to exterminate white people off of the face of the planet to solve this problem. Now, I don't care whether you clap or not, but I'm saying to you that we need to solve this problem because they are going to kill us. And I will leave on that. So we have to just set up our own system and stop playing and get very serious and not be diverted. So their system is not stopping. And then- I'm gonna stop right there. Yo voy a parar because you heard correctly. The frightening part is that not only that people reacted by clapping, we have to exterminate humans, whichever humans, but he's referring to white humans, but in general, no matter what skin color you have, you're a human. And he's talking about exterminating white humans. And this man is still getting engagements to speak. In 2017, I saw a video on YouTube that he was invited to speak at an event. Are you listening? Anybody there? Oh yeah, exterminating white people. I wanna take the white out of it. Exterminating people. Does that sound familiar? Do you remember the Holocaust? Where people were exterminated? because of who they were? How is this not, how is this not shut down for hate speech? How come every time I say, how come every time I come out and say, I, you know, I have doubts about the vaccine or the embargo in Cuba should stay because lifting would only benefit the Cuban regime. I get flagged for hate speech, but a full grown adult comes out on C-SPAN years ago, I believe that was 2005. Video is circulating, I'm glad it's circulating because it's opening a lot of eyes. Talking about exterminating white people because they want to kill us. Who's us? Black people, they want to kill black people? 
So who do you expect is going to exterminate white people? Who are you planning? Who are you counting with on? Who are, who, con quien tu cuenta para matar a toda esta gente blanca? Con quien, who's your army? He also says earlier in that full, in, in a clip completo, he talks about, I want to inform you, but he said inform, I want to, he said, I want to get you information, but not information de información, but in formation, as in formation de militancia, army, militant. What's going on? Explain this to me. What is going on? Why is this not flat for hate speech? Why is this man not canceled? Now I want to post this. And you knew this was coming. What if a white person stands right here and says, we need to exterminate all black people? Well, you know what would happen. Why is it okay for someone independently of their color, the color of their skin to come out in a public forum or any place and say, we need to exterminate other humans. What proof do you have that black, white people are killing you? Oh, and he goes to mention the food, the way they feed us, the medicines they give us. You know, we have choices, correct? If we spend time educating our communities, the minority communi communities, the communities that are vulnerable, that don't speak the language because maybe they're immigrants, if we, as people, do our job in educating our communities, our communities will be better equipped to make better choices. We are killing ourselves. Our communities are killing themselves. Among, we're killing ourselves. Están matando, se están matando entre ellos mismos, los negros, los latinos. Latinos are killing themselves among themselves, making poor choices. Violence. Latino on Latino violence, black on black violence. Why are those things not even mentioned? Why are we jumping to exterminating white people? Not we, why is this man? And, and the scary part is that the original video that I saw, he had so much support in that comment section. I was taken aback. I went into the comments and I was really surprised. Never expected this type of rhetoric to have that much support because this is not even like a, oh, white supremacy, like, you know, no, 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 no. This is extermination. This is, he's talking about exterminating. I'm not sure what methods he's, he would utilize if he were to actually take forward this plan. What is he planning on gassing people? mass murdering people with 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 assault what, what, what is your plan sir to exterminate white people like i don't i have so many questions and at the same time my main question why is this on mainstream and not blocked why was this man on c-span somebody had to know apparently he was immediately um his contract he was a professor at a university <laughs> Apparently his contract was not uh, was not uh, renewed after that that statement. But is that enough? These are people that are molding people's minds, and it's no surprise. This was two thousand five, hace casi diez años. Okay. Now you understand why we have this push, de raza, de de pelea. Esto viene hace rato. This is not new. So anyway, I would like to love you. I, I, would, I would like to love. I would love to hear your comments, to read you, to interact with you, because honestly, this world is kind of crazy, but we're trying to do the best we can to keep ourselves informed and make sure that you keep yourself strong because you know what? This is a war. This is, this is a spiritual and emotional war, and you have to be ready. You have to be armed spiritually and emotionally. Bendiciones. See you next time.